I will for sure.
Wait, what do you mean, dude? Like, hold up. So, Marty actually admitted to being... Wow, that's crazy, dude. Thank you. 
weekend road trip. Spent redefined.
All right, did you know, listen, man. I said sometime this week when I get my card, I'd be launching the clothing line. And as for what you said earlier, did you not read the description? Did you not read the title? It says originals and covers. Some of the shit I've been doing is some of my original shit. So chill out, dude. It's all good, man. No worries. You know, she just proved that she's a royal bitch and 
doesn't know how to look at shit from someone else's perspective. So, you know, it is what it is. And that's just sad when you can't, when you can't look at a situation from another person's perspective, that just really shows how childish you really are, honestly. Like, that really shows that 100%. And she just happened to be too childish still, and that's on her.
And this one right here. I want to get in, I want to dedicate this. To the former basis of this very band who was a very close friend of mine. Um, the song is going out to Sam Cat's former basis, my best friend David Stone King. So David, this is for you, bro. <laughs> Charcoal cleansers suck out two times more dirt, oil, and impurities. Viore, free of force. How much? And this song right here. I um, actually would like to actually dedicate to the lead vocalist of this band. Like I said, I know these guys personally. Um, the last song you heard is by the same band that's called Dreamweaver. Um, 
the actual one dedicated this one to the lead vocals of the band, who I'm still very good friends with to this very day, um, Sandra M1. Nick Van Sankat, obviously. Or Sandy for short. But uh, Sandra, if you're watching this, sis, hope you enjoy this. This is for you.
and say it's time for a proper send off. weekend road trip spent reader fun 